is the moment. Tonight is the night. Hey guys, it's Cryptomio Analysis coming at you with a new video on Staffy, uh, ticker symbol FIS. So, a uh, person asked uh, for this video to be made, so I am making it for them. You're welcome. Uh, so, let's get right into it. Uh, this coin came out in 2020, 33 million market cap, pretty small, almost fully diluted, weird total supply and max supply, but it looks like this coin has a lot of potential. Um, it's on Binance, Coinbase, Kraken, Gate.io, damn, Crypto.com. So this coin's on all the major exchanges, almost all of them, if not all of them. So yeah, let's get right into it. Um, 2020, so this is the wrong graph. Uh, where did this come out? Um, 2020, yeah, so it looks like this is the right graph. Uh, so let's change it to log. Let's look at the RSI, the stock RSI. So as you can see, uh, it, we have been consolidating since May of 2022. This kind of gives me Casper vibes uh, because I've been doing Casper videos. Um, it, it looks like it's just accumulating for the last uh, two years, going on two years, yeah. Next month will be two years. Uh, we are in an uptrend right now, but as long as we're under, let's see. Yeah, so we can't go under 38 cents. And as long as we're under 62.52, uh, then we are bearish still. So you can get something like this where we come back down to the 236 and then move up. Um, but if that doesn't happen, then you are just gonna get cons uh, sideways uh, consolidation until we move up. And the price is gonna be between 38 cents and 62 cents slash 92 cents. Um, again, that's, look, it, it literally did the same thing here uh, that it did here. So um, I wanna say that, you know, uh, the consolidation is between, you know, the 236 and the 0.5. Uh, so the target on the upside right now is going to be 62 cents. It looks like we are closer to the extremely oversold. So with any sort of pullback, us putting us extremely oversold, theoretically, um, we did make a higher low. So um, we are bullish. Uh, keep in mind that we also, I believe, did that here. Yeah, we did that here, but it was like barely. So. Uh, we are we are bullish on uh, Staffy uh, FSI um, because we are still above the 236, but we do need to scream Moon Boy and stay above 382 at 62 cents. Uh, so on the downside for support levels, if you take your fit from the low to the high, you can see that the 0.5 was used as support at 52 cents. Um, that is an area of support. However, keep in mind that if we do fall under Point, the 0.5 at 52 cents. The 618 at 42.60, 42.60 is uh, the next area of support. Uh, and what that's gonna do is it's gonna put the RSI extremely oversold, which is probably gonna trigger a buyback and a, and a nice bounce. How high it can go, I don't know, but as long as we're under the 236 macro, then we're gonna be bearish. However, we're not yet, so it is still technically bullish. Um, those are my targets and those are the next area of support. So, you know, keep in mind if it does come down to 4260, that's a good buying opportunity because that's going to put this in the red. It's going to put the RSI in the red. Uh, it's going to completely reset the stock RSI. And if not, then just don't touch it, right? You're still in an up, you're still in an uptrend. So you don't even need to worry about it because, you know, the next level up is going to be the 62 cents and so on and, and whatever, let's see, whatever the next areas are. Yeah, so 62 cents, 92 cents, dollar 37, and so on. Uh, these are areas of resistance. Obviously, you're going to get selling at these levels. Um, but as long as it stays over the macro targets, and it shouldn't matter even if people sell because you're going to continue this uptrend. Uh, so where do I think Staffy is going to go? If it breaks the all-time high, then it's going to go price discovery mode anywhere between $4 and $39. Uh, keep in mind that it's very possible, especially with the market cap only being $33 billion. So that's gonna put the market cap around 900 million if it actually does go to, uh, actually is it? So 33, 10 times, 330 million, so five bucks, 100 times, 50 bucks, and that, yeah, so $50 is still gonna put the market cap under 5 billion. So again, this is very possible. Price discovery between the all-time high and the 1618 is very possible. And again, that's with good news, that's with the project obviously developing, coming out with news, continue building, um, 
you know, like obviously if it's a good project, it's going to go up and those are the targets. Um, please like, subscribe, comment. Thank you so much for your support and I'll catch you guys in the next video.